All right, so what are we gonna do right quick? Well, not necessarily right quick, but we're gonna try to do it. Hopefully I got good view um, on the camera. These are called Dayton style wheels. And um, on this trailer, I wanna get these wheels off of here, um, but it's a way to do it. So anyway, you wanna loosen these up here, these lugs. And then uh, those bites, those clamps, you want to tap them with the hammer to kind of relieve that pressure. So the reason I'm taking these off because I bought this trailer at an auction, got it at a real good deal, but uh, you know, I want to stop the rust. So I need to deal with this rust. Um, not just the wheels, but throughout the whole trailer. So anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and take this off. This is a good impact. So we're going to impact it and it helps if you can uh, soak it. See that? So just a little bit. Alright. So what I'm also going to do, I'm going to take these lugs. clean them up get a wire brush clean them all up the threads and everything That's all six of them. <laughs> I'll just take this hammer and tap. There you go. So now that you got that tension off of there, um, it's safe to go ahead and remove all the lugs. Now eventually, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna take, um, I'm gonna take off the hubs, so I can get access to the brakes. Then we're gonna put new brakes on it. And I'm thinking about, uh, well, these don't seem too bad. I got two that's pretty bad, uh, the tires. So I was thinking about getting those regrooved. So only way you can get this off, you gotta use a hammer. And you gotta whack at it because it's been on there and it's held on by uh by tension so it's been driven driven too so i did these two already so i'm gonna clean this whole trailer up boy this trailer gonna look sweet 
let me know i'm still kind of on the fence on my color i might go yellow this is a rogers trailer a 97 rogers trailer so i may go yellow i thought about going all black on it um, once i put the reflectors on it it's gonna make it pop anyway um i got the wheels the wheels are gonna be black once i update the wheels and then i'm thinking uh those centers thinking about making those safety red you know that'll kind of make it pop a little bit make it match the the reflectors uh, what else and i may since i'm cleaning up these these lugs you know and those uh those tie down pins I'm probably going to make those the same color. So it'll probably be all safety red. Kind of just like that contrast. I thought it'd be kind of cool. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and knock this. Oh, that, that wasn't bad. So just like that. So... this one it's not too bad but the whole idea is to keep up with this clean this up um because it's only going to keep eating away at this metal so if we can stop this slow it down um we can make this trailer last for another 20 30 years you know it's all about um how you take care of your stuff all right so now this right here uh that's our spacer now we got to get that out and that's going to be more elbow grease so what i like to do is take this right here nice piece of metal and you just got a hit on it so i got this supported of course so you got to try to stay safe so you hit it rotate and it's just repeat that and just keep repeating that process and eventually it yeah, break there we go so we already broke but you see all this chunks of rust falling off you know so that's what we don't want because rust is a cancer and it kills and it kills slow That's the process. You just got to keep working at it. It's coming off probably what two th two thirds of a two thirds of an inch, something like that.
notes. Well, that's the process. It's about, it's about off. that's off to get that out the way so you see all this so this wheel this dating style wheel goes completely onto this hub and it's been on there for so long and should be pretty much seized on there a little bit so like I was saying you're just gonna need a little bit of elbow grease to get that out and when I go back to clean this up I'm a wire brush wire wheel to all this you know get all that as best as I can all the way around and then also that kind of take that layer off of there that's you know making it bite but we're gonna put three coats of paint on it um, as protection uh, so I might go I'm thinking I'm probably gonna go all black anyway but anyway I'm gonna knock this off take some hitting to get it spray a little oil on there Get back up in there and give it a few whacks. Probably 
right in there. Yeah, see? See that? Boom, got him. Right there. Boom. There we go. So I don't know, what was that about? About 10 minutes. And uh, they go on much easier. Then they went off. Ah. This one right here, I think it may have a, a leaking seal inside there anyway. So uh, I won't know, I gotta take this off here, get a special nut remove all that and uh you know seal it all back up but anyway i'm gonna clean all this up pull the hubs off clean them all up i gotta change do a brake job change all that out you know so that's that's what i plan on doing ah. but just to see see all that see that's pretty bad you just wanna you wanna you wanna save this you know it's still, it's still life in this, in this trailer. So look, let me see. All right, so right here, see that? That's breaking down. We're gonna put some new metal in here. We're gonna bend that, weld that. We're gonna go through all this uh, suspension parts and uh, we're gonna clean them all up. And wherever we see that they're weak, we're going to add new metal into that. Um, so that that's that's pretty much it. And then, of course, the boards and the lights and all that stuff. But for the most part, you know, she pulls good, uh, decent tires, at least over here. You know, she get the job done. This is for my big, uh, my big dump truck. You know, when that time come. Uh.